drought and agricultural production loss is a reality for sub-Saharan Africa, disproportionately hit by changes in global climate and pest infestation. But the African Development Bank is bringing agricultural technologies from the lab to Africa's farmlands to mitigate those challenges. The Bank's Technologies for African Agricultural Transformation, or TART initiative, is putting the best technologies into the hands of farmers. We need collaborating partners such as TART in order to come in and complement what the government is already doing. For Ethiopian farmers like Elfnesh Bekele, the pressure to produce wheat is high. That's because Ethiopia imports a third of this cereal. The local wheat sector can't keep up with the national demand. TART funds are providing 28,000 farmers like Bekele with seed that can withstand the lowlands' high temperatures. It's part of an Ethiopian government program to expand wheat production into 400,000 lowland irrigated areas. Ethiopia, partnered with International Center for Agricultural Research in Dry Areas, could leverage TART to see Ethiopia be wheat self-sufficient within four years. TART also aims to scale up heat-tolerant wheat production tenfold, producing up to a million tons of wheat creating 220,000 jobs and doubling farmer incomes. Elfnesh Bekele says her increased income will allow her to put her children in a better school and someday to buy a tractor. Steps away from this heat-tolerant wheat, Sudanese farmers are basking in the tart spotlight. And no one is more excited than farmer Daf Allah Mohammed Ahmed. والله التقاوي دي طبعا شكلها ده مستوي ما فيه تفاوت يعني ما فيه خلطة في النوعية Like most farmers participating in Sudan's TART funded program Ahmed's wheat yield increased from 2.5 tons to 5 tons per hectare Sudan is a TART shining star having trained more than 1,400 farmers and stakeholders almost half of them women and youth. The initiative also increased Sudan's wheat growing areas and partnered with the private sector to produce 45,000 tons of seed, enough to cover all of Sudan's targeted wheat production areas with high-yielding, heat-tolerant wheat. Working with ICADA and the Agricultural Research Corporation, Sudan could leverage TART funds to produce another 60,000 tons of seed and improve the value chain in terms of grain storage and transport, among other goals. It's quite amazing what can happen when you get the right, the right seed, um, but also the right training uh, to farmers uh, at the right time. TART takes the best global agricultural technologies and adapts them to Africa's needs to create jobs, to empower women and youth, to help build economies, to help feed Africa.